Hello boys and girls. I hope you're having a good day today. I'm going to read you a lovely story about a crab. Sharing a Shell by Julia Donaldson and illustrated by Lydia Monks. Look, a crab with no shell. Tap, tap, tap. You can't come in. You can't share a shell with me. Or me, or me, or me. Nobody would share with the crab who had no shell. Look, a gull with a wide open beak. Run for your life, crab! Hide! At last, in a pool, an empty shell. Quick crab scuttle inside to see him. He's gone inside. One crab safe in his shell under the summer sun, roaming all over the rock pool in his wonderful home for one. Look, a blob, a bright purple blob. What can this blob thing be? Go away blob, whoever you are. You can't share your shell with me. I'm an enemy, not a blob. Please let me share your shell. Give me a ride to look for some food and perhaps I can help you as well. Look, a fish with jaws open wide. Fresh crab for dinner. Here goes. Out shoots a tentacle, quick as a flash, stinging the fish on the nose. Look, his tentacle stinging the fish on the nose. Two friends sharing a shell under a sky of blue, romping all over the rock pool in their wonderful home for two. A lovely rock pool. Look, a brush thing trying to get in. Just like a brush thing trying to get in, wiggling and making a fuss. Go away, brush, whoever you are. You can't share a shell with us. I'm not a brush, I'm a bristle worm. Please let me in. Don't be mean. I love doing housework. I'll suck up the scraps and keep the shell lovely and clean. So we have the anemone, the crab and the bristle worm all going to share the shell. Three friends sharing a shell down by the sparkling sea, rollicking all over the rock pool in their wonderful home for three. But look how they've grown. The shell is too small. You're getting too heavy, says Crab. I'm fed up with being your taxi. It's time that you found a new cab. Really, said Blob, how ungrateful. Here I am, slaving away, scaring off all the fierce fishes. If that's how you feel, I won't stay. Oh, they look very cross. Peace cries Brush, but nobody hears. The other two creatures split up. Blob finds an empty ice cream tub and Crab finds a nice paper cup. Crab in the cup, Blob in, Blob in the tub, each one pretends to be glad. 
Brush is doing both lots of housework and he knows they are lonely and sad. Oh no, look. Look, a storm, a terrible storm, crashing and flashing all night. Two homes smashed on the rocks. Oh, what a terrible sight. Oh no, look, all broken. But look, a shell, a beautiful shell. Crab and an enemy stare, too shy to speak to each other and too proud to say, shall we share? Listen, a voice and out pokes a head from the whelk shell washed up by the foam. It's ready, I've done all the housework, climb on and come in and welcome home. Three friends sharing a shell, happy as housemates can be, rocketing all around the rock pool in their wonderful home for three. The end. I hope you enjoyed that, boys and girls. Thank you for listening. Bye bye.